Hey, so it's been a while since I posted to my channel and I wanted to do something a little different and I hope you enjoy. Hey, good morning everyone. I'm back with another video. We are in the pool and we wanted to show you all an aerobics routine. I'm here with my sister-in-law, Davina. Hi. <laughs> so have you done water aerobics before? Yes, I have. And you like it? Love it. Okay, what's your favorite type of workout routine? Like what's your preference? Um, I like um, any type of workout. I love the gym, I love running, I love walking, anything that has to do with exercise, I'm fine. Great, so um, stay tuned. We will show you all a simple water aerobics routine and I hope you enjoy. So get into this pool in her housing complex. I love it. Um, she gave me the idea to do a water aerobics routine. So as soon as she put that bug in my ear, I researched some exercises. We went out and bought pool noodles that were about $1.50 to assist us with our workout. So before we started the actual aerobic routine, we began with a very quick warm up just to gradually raise our body temperatures and to increase the flow of blood to our muscles. The water was really cold, so the warm up definitely helped us prepare for the workout. So let's get into the actual routine. It consisted of five different exercises and we did 20 reps of each exercise. And right now we are doing a modified jumping jack. And for the second exercise, we are doing high knees which is pretty difficult because water is denser than air. So even though working out in the water is fun, it provides a lot more resistance. And you might not recognize this move, but right now we are doing butt kicks in the water. And as I mentioned previously, water is denser than air. So kicking our butts in the water requires a lot more effort which is good because that means we're burning more calories. For the third exercise, we are using the noodles to touch our toes. And this was pretty difficult, but I just love water aerobics because it's low impact and it doesn't put a lot of pressure on your joints. And for our final exercise in this routine, we did high kicks and we use the pool noodles as a marker for how high we should kick our legs. And it may seem like we're doing a lot of leg exercises in this routine. But one thing that I love about water aerobics is that it really works your entire body. Not only does it work your legs, but your arms, your shoulders, and your core. So just to recap, our water aerobics routine consisted of five different exercises. We did a modified jumping jack, high knees, butt kicks, toe touches, and forward kicks. And we decided to do four rounds of each set, but depending on your fitness level, you can do more or less. One thing I forgot to mention about water aerobics is that you don't necessarily need equipment in order to exercise in the pool. We use the noodles just because we wanted to, but for beginners or even more advanced swimmers, you don't need any equipment to exercise in the water. Thank you and I hope you enjoyed the video.